Hey guys, it's Megan. Um, so basically, I have another haul for you guys. Um, if I sound kind of weird, I have this weird, like, stuffy nose, stuffy but runny nose going on. I'm, like, not sick, but that's going on. So if I sound weird, that's why. And this haul is another Target slash Ulta, mostly Target, but a little bit of Ulta haul. I'm going to go through the Target stuff first, and I will try everything on for you. Um, basically, everything I have is it's my favorite type of clothing. I wear it every single day. It's not, like, fancy or, like, it's not over-the-top cute. Okay, no, I think it's really cute, but it's just, like, those basic everyday pieces that you can throw on with leggings, you can put on with jeans and cute shoes and kind of dress it up if you want to feel put together, but you don't have to try very hard. So that's basically what I got. And some tank tops, but. So, the first thing I got is this shirt I'm wearing right now. I got two of them. They were in the tank top section and it was like buy two for 16 or one for nine. So you save $2 if you get two. Um, but it's just a navy blue tank top and the back is razorback um but it's it's not like super form fitting like a normal tank top which you'll see when i like stand up and do the try on part But I also got it in another color, and the other color I got is more of a springy, summery color, which I need y'all to tell me if this clashes with my hair. Here's the tank top. See how it's kind of flowy? And it kind of drapes. It like kind of does like a curvy drape thing. And then the back is um, razor back. And I got this in an extra large, too. And these were, I believe... Oh wait, these were two for 16. Yeah, these were two for 16. So there's that. I'll show you all my tank tops first. So then these other tank tops were also two for um, two for sixteen. So basically, normally I wear an extra large at Target in like shirts and stuff, but I've lost about between fifteen to seventeen pounds. Um, so everything I got besides these tank tops, so I wanted them to be flowy, and then this one it just ran super small. Everything else I got was in a large, which I'm really excited about. I still want to lose like 50, 60 more pounds, but. So far, I'm doing pretty good because I'm not good at eating healthy. <laughs> I'm the worst at eating healthy. So this is the tank top. I actually got this in a 2X. But it's just a v-neck tank top, but I don't know if you can tell, but it's ribbed. I don't know. I love ribbed, I loved ribbed tank tops. I think they're so cute. This is... So I got that in black. That was a 2X. But then in the same section for the 2 for 16, they had like the normal material tank tops. And I got this one in a large. Which is just so weird that the ribbed... I feel like ribbed ones usually are still really stretchy. So I don't know what's going on with that. But I got a white. This one's just straight. It's not... Or swooped. I don't know how you say that. But it's not a v-neck. But it's just a white tank top. I haven't had a white tank top in months and I've been meaning to buy one because who doesn't need a white tank top? Everyone needs a white tank top, so. I'm still stuck in like the fall colors, so it was hard for me not to get fall colors but this one's kind of like spring summer 
and this is a large this was i want to say 12.99 nothing i got was over 15 dollars. i don't know if i already said that but this one was 12.99 and this was also razorback i need to get a strapless bra but so this is like the spaghetti strap at the top type razorback but it's just one of those flowy tank tops but the cool thing about it is it has those lines down the sides and then more material where it like makes you look slimmer if you can even tell i don't know but I'll, you'll see when i try it on but it's like that really pretty like minty teal aqua -y color which who doesn't love this color and i feel like with me it kind of makes me look like a mermaid so i got that basically the same but kind of different the first one I really wanted to get it in olive green because olive green just goes so good with red hair but my friend was like Meg olive green is a fall color you don't need olive green so I got this which once again it looks darker on the camera which I don't know if that's just me looking to the viewfinder but it's more of a it's still kind of a wine color, but it's more in that like berry purple, like lighter berry purple shade. So I feel like it'll be fine in the spring. But it's t-shirt, like short sleeves, but then it has like that peplum flow, flowiness going on. So these are the shirts that I'm talking about where you can dress them down, you know, just throw on a pair of jeans or you can do like cute wedges, maybe a cute necklace and like do your makeup nice and like still feel put together and like be able to go out to dinner or do something a little nicer but it's so comfy and you can just throw it on these are my favorite shirts like i will wear these shirts every single day of my life same little section but it's like thick um, tank top material or material thick tank top straps and this is kind of like that blue but like slightly teal color and it also has that like flare out but this one's cool because it's where it goes down farther on the sides and it's so freaking flattering oh my god and then the back has like just a little keyhole thing going on. This is also large. You can hear the wind howling across the ocean. So that's all I got from Target. Spent my whole gift card, less twenty dollars. So, but no, like I said, nothing was over fifteen dollars. So I thought it was a really good deal. And then I just got two things at Ulta. I got a Buxom lip cream. What are they called? They have like a legit name. What's it called? Full on lip cream. And I have White Russian. That's my favorite. And it's called Dolly. Oh my god. This is what the like this is what the color says it is like on the packaging, but this is what it looks like. Oh my god. It's so freaking pretty. I freaking love it. Um, but yeah, this is Dolly. And it kinda these are like the cooling lip glosses, but I really like the lip creams because I don't think they feel sticky at all. And uh they're like cool though, they're like they, mm, they're like so cooling on your lips, they're so good for summer. But I don't know if the color is translating, 
But this color, oh my god, I'm looking at myself in my mirror. It's so pretty. It's so freaking pretty. I think I might actually like this one more than White Russian. But White Russian's a good one to put on, like, over the top of another lipstick. And then I also got, I wanted to get, my favorite eyeliner is the Stila, like, liquid felt tip or I think it's felt tip whatever liner but it's the black color but it's been out of stock both times I've been old to this month so I decided to get this one and I wear brown mascara a lot especially recently I've been more into like the I don't know if this would be considered natural but more natural with like brown mascara instead of like a wing black wing and thick black eyelashes I'll do the brown um I mean they're still thick I use their real but I've been doing that, and I love to do a brown um, liner in my top waterline to, like, thicken it up and just, I don't know, make me, I don't know. It just makes it look better, but I saw this color. It's called Lionfish, and I needed a brown liner because the only one I have is, like, 10 years old, and it's, like, crusty. But this color, oh, my gosh. I don't know if it'll, like, translate. Oh, it's probably not going to translate, but it's just like the perfect brown. It has like a slight shimmer to it, and it looks so good in the waterline. I did it today just a little bit. Can you tell? I don't know. I freaking love it, but I got this. Um, you can't like twist it up and down. It says you put the cap on, and I think it just like opens up more on its own, but we're going to have to figure that out because... We need to make sure it works good. I'm not trying to get like three uses out of this. I want this to last a few months. So these are the only two things I got at Ulta. I got 20% off. So I think before the discount, it was maybe $45 and I got it for $35. So it was a pretty good deal. Um, but yeah, this is kind of random, but I just thought I would haul it for you guys. So you could see like what kind of stuff they have at Target. They have a ton of swimsuits at Target right now too. Um, I'm not swimsuit ready though, so, and I don't really get my swimsuits at Target anyway. The tops, they don't, they don't work. Like, it says extra large for the top, right? So you think, okay, it's an extra large, they probably need more room. So they just make the freaking band freaking massive, and the cup size is still so small, so my boobs are, like, squishing out of them. And I went in there today, and they had, like, actual cup sizes for some of them, but the highest they did was, like, 36D. Um, and I wear, what, if right now, well, I've lost some weight, my boots have gotten a little smaller, but, like, last time I got checked, it was a 40 triple D, I think. I used to wear 36 D, though, and I pulled up that cup, it was, like, this big. I'm like, this is not a freaking 36 D, so I don't really buy swimsuits there anyway, but they have a lot of cute ones if you have, like, smaller booms, <laughs> or, like, a smaller frame. They have really cute swimsuits, but, anyways, I just wanted to go through and haul that for you guys and get, like, a a little video up for you guys and once again if anyone has a sony a5000 that wants to tell me how to do the settings because i don't know if this is like a real i'm sorry i keep saying like oh my god i'm so annoying i hate when people do that but if you have this camera i don't know what settings are good i don't know if this is clear or if i'm doing it completely wrong so and i'm pretty sure i'm filming this Ooh. I went to Starbucks today and I got this black mango tea lemonade or something and it was so freaking good. It was like 80 calories. So if you're trying to watch your weight but you still want to go to Starbucks, try that. It's so freaking good. Just saying. But anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Have a good weekend or a good day or whenever you watch this. Bye. Maybe. Mm -mm -mm.